Yo, Navatos, thanks again for tuning in to yet another video. And we have here the 2023 models from Harley Davidson, of course. Now, they haven't really shown anything new. Uh, we might see the CVOs when they announce them at the dealer event. Uh, another bike that's not on here, of course, is the Nightster. So I did mention that we are probably getting a new Nightster for 2023. Uh, a Nightster uh, special, maybe. So that, that could be probably the reason why we don't see a Nightster on this list. If you're looking at it, of course, we just have the Sportster S as the sport. And then we have all the other, you know, cruising, American touring, adventure touring, and then we have the trike. So um, based off of, you know, just the information that I see here, it's just more new colors, right? They didn't do anything with uh, the engine, the, uh, the engine displacement. They didn't do anything as far as, uh, you know, riding modes, nothing. So it's just basically just colors. That's that's all I see here, uh, which is, you know, typically manufacturers after five years, they do a refresh and they do that so they can so they can uh, just keep these these bikes, you know, just just looking different or just an update, a little bit more of a bigger update typically five years is the number that that we see when uh when these manufacturers decide to kind of do something hold on give me a minute anyways back into uh the video um oh yes five years is typically what we see when a uh when, when an auto manufacturer typically a manufacturer auto uh when that's when we typically see like a refresh like a new bumper a new fender uh, a new grill, something, you know, along those lines, maybe a, uh, a redesigned headlights, you know, or uh, wheels, kind of like what Harley did uh, last year. So I guess, I guess that's the big update last year was the wheels. So we got a few new colors here. We have the, this billiard blue, which is kind of like a coral reef blue, a little bit. Uh, we have seen this color before. We have a gray haze. I don't think I've seen this one before. This is new. We have a sand pearl. I'm, you know what? I really like the sand pearl. It's, it's a good looking color. You guys got to see this color in person. If you guys saw the 2022 road glides, uh, if you saw the fat bob, the sand pearl, it's it's a it's a real beautiful color. It it looks a hundred times better um, in the um, in the daylight. Speaking of which, uh, we have the lowrider S, and the new color is white sand pearl for 2023. So if you got a 2022 gunship gray, you locked out. Uh, if you got maybe a Barracuda Silver, I guess, uh, that color is still better than Crimson Red. So then <laughs> you locked out on 2020. But man, you know what? Black still looks good. So let's just take a quick look at this White Sand Pearl. It looks like the shade's a little bit different. But you know what? It's more of a like a cream or like a bone. So I don't know. It's, was this the same White Sand Pearl? Was that the same for 2022? colors i remember like a sam pearl was on uh was on the fat bob and the road glide on some of the touring models they had but this looks a little bit different i don't know maybe maybe i'm not memorizing or maybe i'm not remembering right but i i believe white sam pearl was was one of the colors in 2022 i might be mistaken i don't know you guys let me know in the comments maybe maybe my memory doesn't serve me right uh Anyways, going back, of course, let's just do a quick look at uh, the colors. Gray haze, like I said, I, that that's a new color. I don't think I've seen that. So the soft tail standard is still around with the 107, of course, 14.3. Wow, did the street ball price went up? 16.5? Was that? Wow, what happened? I don't remember this being over 16,000. Wasn't this uh, like 15.3? So this went up another thousand. Oh, and they got mustard yellow back. Looks like uh, <laughs> looks like mustard yellow's back. When did they have this color? Like, was this back in 2018 or 2019? Yeah. So they have that color. When did this go up to 16.5? Did they remove the um, the surcharge? Wow, their surcharge is still there. So on top of 16.5. Now there's a surcharge. Ooh, wow. So the prices went up a lot. Uh, wasn't this 15.3? I remember this being 15,300. And now there's a surcharge on top of that. 
and still no B and still no ABS. Uh, I also looked at the Lowrider S, of course, and that also does not have ABS. So, yeah, the prices went up. Was this this appears to be almost about the same 18 18 two. So here we have the Lowrider ST, and of course, uh, you know, White Sand Pearl 2023. That's the color. I don't know. You guys, let me know in the comments. You guys like that color, or 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 do you guys prefer? You guys pers or <laughs> do you guys prefer Gunship Gray? I, I would I would lean towards Gunship Gray. So you still have ABS standard. That's probably the only soft tail that will have ABS standard. Is the uh, is the Lowrider ST? So I mean, bang for your buck, the Lowrider the Lowrider ST is still is still the best. Uh, you know, the best for your for your buck right now because you also have you also have um, cruise control that's also included on the Lowrider ST. You have cruise control, which is you know that's like a three hundred dollar option, and I mean that is if you could even find the part because right now there's a lot of people waiting. Uh, for for cruise control on their bikes plus you also have to pay for the flash which is ha you know half half the cost so that could be 80 bucks depending where you live so i mean you have some benefits bang for your buck the lowrider st is still in my opinion the the, the best the best option frame mounted fairing uh you know you got the nice wheels the 117 you have saddlebags you have a lot you know a lot a lot a lot to like here with the lowrider st of course and all of that under twenty three thousand, so I, I don't think this price went up twenty two two hundred. No, that was that was actually the same price from last year. So for some reason, the street bob went up by a thousand bucks. Doesn't make any sense. I don't I don't even think they added anything other than, uh, yeah, it's still the same. It's got the cast wheels, the passenger uh, uh, pillion seat, and yeah, it's the same. I don't know why this went up. Man, that's a huge difference. So let's look at the fat bob you have that uh the gray haze as well uh there's a silver metallic here uh where is it at? i saw it oh okay it's probably oh here it is so we have the silver metallic and that appears to be the uh the 2022 street bob is it no it's not this is a lighter shade of gray uh yeah that's a lighter shade of of gray so that's yeah that's a that's a new silver i much preferred the street bob 2022 uh, metallic gray but yes it looks like yes this is a different shade of of silver i can't remember the name of the 2022 but it was a it was just a shade darker than this but this is of course one of the new colors i guess for 2023 and you also have this in red uh red line red which is you know the same one as uh, last year so looks like yeah, like always, they, they take colors out and then they, they go ahead and, and put old ones back in. Let's see. Oh, okay, this is Prospect Gold. So maybe this is like the mustard yellow I was mentioning. Yeah. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Not a huge fan. This special looks pretty neat. It looks all right, this one. I mean, it's all right. Here, so here's that... Uh, Okay, so gray haze. Maybe this one's a little bit closer to the uh, to the metallic of 2022. So, yeah, it's just color options. Looks like it's the same Prodigy wheels from from last year. Uh, yeah, same Enforcer wheels on the standards, of course. Nothing really has changed. Uh, we have a couple specials here. Just color options, same wheels, same same everything. Uh, 114 on all of these and of course we have the sts and the sts they have that white sand pearl and uh we also have the pan america special and yeah that's it i mean just it's just mustard yellow and a silver color that's what we get for 2023 nothing else i mean it's harley so i don't know you guys let me know in the comments if you guys bought a 2022 uh gunship gray bike uh i would be you know very happy with uh buying a 2022 model after seeing these colors not a not a huge fan this one's still yeah this is still the same color of 2022 i, I test rode this one uh you know uh last year it's, it's 20 it's 2023 wow so yeah, let's just look at this uh, gray haze. I don't think I've seen this one. 
Wow, so this one actually looks pretty good. I, I like this mixture of the gray haze with the silver metallic. And it's got like a yellow pinstripe or something like that. I can't really zoom in, but it's got a nice highlight to it. I like the wheels, the updated wheels, the 2022 wheels. I'm, I'm a fan of, of those. I really like these uh, these big fat tires on these on the on the fat boy. Uh, you know, you test ride this thing, you'd be surprised how how well it handles, and that big you know fat front tire, how well it takes the imperfections of the road. Uh, the big fat rear wheel, you really feel the difference. Uh, you know, just gripping and the transfer of power when it comes to the 114 on the on the fat boy. But uh, yeah, that's pretty much it. You know, I'm not gonna be rambling quite a bit, but uh, what are we gonna see for the for the dealer show? We're gonna see, I believe we're gonna see the Nightster special. Uh, so they're holding off on that, and uh, I don't. I don't know if they're gonna maybe we'll see a new uh you know revolution max model maybe but that might be it the nightster special and um anything other than that as far as uh you know the cvo's of course maybe they're holding off on the cvo's and i don't think that's you know i think that's pretty much it so cvo's uh, the 120 edition, of course, the you know, the 120, uh, the anniversary edition bikes. Maybe we'll see some some color options uh, with that and probably the nicer special. And that's pretty much it. So, you guys go ahead and leave your comments down below. Let me know what you guys think. Are you guys excited for the dealer show in, what is it, two weeks from now? You guys stay out there. Stay safe. Don't believe everything you read. Life's a risk. Get out there and ride. Later.